Hi, Christine. Thanks for sending us in your math question. The first thing I'm going to do is uh, graph all the points that you sent in, and um, we're going to find the uh, perimeter of the figure. So the point zero 01 is right here, because you go right 0 and then up 1. So that's L. And then the next point is 3, 5. So 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And here's M here. And then the next point is N, which is 5, 5. So we go right 5, 3, 4, 5, and then up 5. So that's this point right here. And then the last point is 5, 1, which is P right here. Okay, so here is our figure. And it looks like it's a trapezoid. So the kind of the hard part here is actually LM. Otherwise, all the other parts are pretty uh, straightforward as far as their distances go. So let's look at uh, LP first. So the distance LP, so from here to here, is just simply 5. Okay, and then the distance from N to P here is uh, 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay. And then distance from MN there is 2. Okay. And then the last distance, LM, we have to use the distance formula. Okay. The distance formula, uh, I'll write it down here, is x1 minus x2 quantity squared plus y1 oops, minus y2 quantity squared. Okay, so then we're going to plug in our uh, points here. So L is 0, 1, so we're going to go 0 minus, and then M, so the x value, I'll write down our points here. So we have 0, 1, and then M is 3, 5. So we're going to use uh, these two points here. So we're going to go 0 minus 3 squared plus, and then we're going to go 1, because that's y1, minus 5 squared. Okay, so to get a better idea, this is x1, y1, x2, and then y2. Okay. Um, all right. So if we simplify our radical here, We'll get negative 3 squared, which is 9, plus 1 minus 5 is negative 4. And if you square that, you get 16. All right, and then we get the square root of 25 when we add them. And the square root of 25 is 5. Okay, so now in order to find the perimeter, we should have to add up these three values here, and then our 5. So the perimeter is going to equal... 5 plus 4 plus 2 plus 5. So our perimeter is going to be 9 plus 7, which is 16. All right. Thanks, thanks Christine, for sending us in your uh, math question. And we look forward to answering more of your questions in the future.